What up, Grand? It's your Grand Dad. you got a black abstract. You're locked in once again, and I appreciate you for it. Do me a favor. Make sure you like, subscribe, and the notification bell so we can do this again. So what I want to talk about today is an incident that happened uh, in this region, West Seneca. Uh, apparently, an elderly man, uh, 90 years old of age, was leaving a supermarket, got into his vehicle, and apparently he mistook the, uh, the gas for the brake, and all hell broke loose. Let's take a look. Again, in his 90s, mistaking the gas for the brake goes quickly in reverse, hitting three signs before starting to move forward, hitting an SUV and another sign. There were no citations and no one was hurt. Ooh, that was tough. Uh, so apparently if you didn't see, well, I know you saw it, but let's break it down what happened. He got in the vehicle, proceeded to pull off, uh, reverse into three signs, then pull forward and hit a vehicle. Uh gentleman was, like I said, was 90 years old. Um, I guess they are submitting a um, a request for driver review um, that you, I guess anybody can do, do this in New York State. You can submit a request for driver review if there are specific concerns due to a person's actions, health, behavior, and... uh driving incident uh listen i see this a lot from where i'm from uh i used to work at a car wash i'm not gonna say the name because they don't pay me to say the name but at this specific car wash they have a convenience store and it has glass and i used to work at this specific establishment and elderly people used to park in front and i seen this all the time they would try, they would mistake the gas for the brake vice versa and i seen them go straight through this window like numerous on numerous occasions. Uh, I guess there's a um, word going around that they're going to try to implement and make it a law when you get a certain age that you have to retake your uh, either permit test or your driver's license test, uh, which I think there's nothing wrong. I've been thinking this for years. They should have did this uh, because, you know, you not only got your life and, and, and what not in your own hands, but you, you got other people's life and uh, you're putting every other people at risk. Thankfully, nobody was in that parking lot. But what if it was? What if it was some lady walking with her kid? What if it was somebody walking with her dog? What if it was somebody just walking? Period. Uh, it could have been a lot worse situation than what it was. Um, from far as I've been know, far as I know, I don't think this gentleman was hurt, uh, which is, you know, I, I don't want to see anybody get hit or hurt. But. Uh, we we have to figure something to do with these elderly people because if they're not doing stuff like this, they're driving 20 miles per hour in the 60 um, and people are blowing their horn, wondering what's going on, or they're holding up the, the, the throughway and you get near them and they're like this, looking straight ahead, can't, can't even turn their neck. And listen, I feel, listen, I, re, I got nothing but respect for elderly people, you know? You, 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 you earned your right. To, to still be driving. And I, it's kudos to you if you're of that age and still get up and get out and go in your car and still get around because a lot of motherfuckers just gave up. Like, man, I ain't doing this shit no more, man. Call a medical cab. Take me where I need to be. So kudos to that. But at the same time, if you, if you know that you're not up to par to be driving, you shouldn't be driving. That's it. That's just simple as that. Uh... As far as I know, this, this gentleman wasn't arrested, and I don't think he should have been arrested, but they just issued him a citation. So my question to you is, do you think that at a certain age they should reevaluate uh, your driving? Should, they, should you retake the whole procedure over? Should you retake just the license portion of it, the written test, uh, the, the, the driver ed course? Something got to give because uh, not only for the safety of others, but for the safety of these older people too, you know, um, certain age, I think they should have some kind of transport to to get you where you need to go. Um, gentlemen, is ninety is not going to be as sharp as it used to be. I don't care what good uh, health you're in, et cetera, et cetera. It's just not going to happen. Uh, but this is crazy. <laughs> this was nuts, man. I watched this video probably about twenty times. Like, what the hell? Like I said, I've seen this close hand, man. I've seen this up close and, and personal, uh, you know, and thankfully nobody was 
hurt in those instances. But when they drove through that convenience store, there was people in that store. It was, it had a Subway in there, it had a Dunkin' Donuts. It, I don't know. Uh, post your comments below. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, make sure you like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Uh, let's talk about it. Peace.